hello everybody in this video we will uh, add some more menus and uh, let's add uh, about menu so we already have this main menu so we can duplicate this menu control D and now one another menu is created with these uh, things already added okay so what we can do we can rename it to about menu and then we can customize things inside so title we will change to about and we will hide this menu for time disable it and then uh, here we will change these buttons okay one thing we will add uh, okay later on we will do that no problem and this quit button we will change it to back back to main menu okay so that's nice now we can duplicate this title and we can change it to about text and then we will make it size to be 48 yeah 48 is fine so we'll align it to left align and then we can add some text here so for example uh, some text about text here okay we I will add it later on so about I will add it later on no problem so then our about menu is ready now we will add another menu control D and this will be our options options menu we will also modify this menu later on so for time we will only add options menu title and we will add some options over here uh, later on so after options menu we uh, we will add another menu control D and this menu we will hide and this menu will be our uh, select level level select menu okay so So we will uh, select the level and select uh, we will say uh, level select we will say select uh, mode yeah we will say it select mode we will delete the about menu and uh, uh, here we will add button another button okay UI and uh, button and here uh, this button will be our first mode which will be for example off-road then we can scale this button to 160 and we will add this over here and we'll make it 200 200 and 250 yeah now I think it's 
nice and this is off road button and we will place it a little bit higher and then we will add a text okay and we will say it off road we will change it to Jupiter and uh, 36 and then we will make the color to white and our flow and then we will place it here okay after adding here we will just uh, add it inside off-road okay so like this so now I will just add an image uh, for reference and later on we will uh, get our off-road images and uh, with level images and then we will place it that image is here okay so for time I am just adding this sprite here so okay so now I think uh, uh, we should make it uh, 300 x axis so yeah now it's quite good now we will add the text and we will duplicate it duplicate and duplicate okay so now it's nice so we will add the images later on and the second one will be uh, for example tra racing track tracks you can say and the last one will be city so we have added these three select modes okay uh, tracks so that's nice this is our level selection menu and we will duplicate this menu and we will just hide this menu and we will say car select and here we will select some cars and we don't need to uh, name uh, this text here and this one and this one and we will make it car one car three okay so we have created these buttons also we can just make it the size will be a little bit bigger and so the cars should be visible and okay so now that's great here we will just place some differentiating icons just for time and level select we will just add different images here okay so that's nice now we have created the levels and uh, the menus and now we want to move from one menu to another menu so how we will do that 
so let's highlight the main menu and on play menu we want to move it to this uh, level select menu okay and then from level select we will move it to car select so uh, we will select play and we will come here on click option we also want to add some button sound okay so we have audios here and we have button click audio yeah this audio is fine so we will just add a audio com source here and I will name it button click and uh, we will move it here and play on awake we will disable it now on play button we will on on click option we will drag drop this click button here and we will select all the buttons and on click and then we will move this option because we want to apply this on all buttons so now we will select play button and here on uh, this uh, after audio we will we want to hide this main menu so we will drag drop this main menu here and here we will select game object set active bool and we will hide it okay it's in default it's hidden so we will click plus and we will add level select here menu and we will enable it by checking this bool element okay so now play button is active after that we will select about and in about we will add another function and we will select about menu here and we will enable about menu and here we will disable main menu okay so we will disable this main menu so that's nice now we will select options menu and similarly we will select options here it's very easy and it's quite nice function inside unity because we don't need any programming for these buttons so options and quit button we will uh, in next video we will program quit with loading bar so that's it for main menu we will hide the main menu and in about menu we will move to about menu and on this back button okay we will add on click function and first we will add button click sound play oh we didn't select it play in that buttons so we will do that no problem so the another thing we want to add is that we want to hide about menu when we click on back so we will hide it and then we will enable main menu when we will be back okay so that's nice we have done with about menu as well so similarly with other menus we will do the same thing that's great we have uh, added all back buttons as well so now the last thing we will add some background music so i will create a audio source and let's name it background music and we have some music here let's check this this is not good and this was good three was good this was good I think yeah 
this music is quite good so we will select background music and we will add this music here and we will select play on awake and we will repeat loop okay so but we will make the volume 2.7 maybe so because it's too high so play the game now we can test our menus so about back options play okay so that's nice we have successfully added other menus and definitely select levels select car menus will be uh, implemented later on after creating the levels system and for time we will in next video we will add loading uh, bar system loading system and uh, we will also add quit function so let's meet in next video goodbye